Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Welcome again to the Modern Muslim Project channel. And I'm Nick. I'm Nas. Alright, so we are still addressing a question on wedding. Mm. And the question is, says like this. Can I just get married because I want to have Zubiat? I want to have children but I'm not so into the idea of getting married. Mm. Oh, I want to get married just because I want to have kids. Okay, I think this is a very tricky question. Eh? Get married because of kids, because you want to have kids. Um, it's not a matter of can or cannot. I think it's mm. unfair for me to give an answer yes or no, can or cannot. I think it takes more than that. Because um, ultimately, the reason that we agree to settle down, the reason that we agree to get married, the very reason we say yes to that particular proposal should be because of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. It has to go back to Him. Mm -hmm. It is not supposed to be because of this man, because of family pressure, because of um, uh, wanting to have children and things like that. All those come after the very core intention of doing it because of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala because Nick I just imagine tau, if you get married for the sole purpose of having Zuriel and who can guarantee that you're going to have Zuriel yeah. nobody can guarantee you that right you might be trying you might be hoping you might be making loads of dua but this is something which is beyond our control okay so getting back to the question just now you get married because you want to have Zuriel and nobody can guarantee that you got married and Allah test you with no zuriat. Mm -hmm. What's going to happen? So you're just going to break that marriage? You're going to just stop because your your objective of that marriage is not met. Okay, so it's, it's not going to be healthy then. But if you get married because of Allah, whatever comes after that, whatever challenges, trials and tribulations, because marriage is not about walking on bed of roses. Eh? Marriage is about walking on lots of thorns with a little bit roses at the back at the end. Okay, so if the objective, if the core intention is because of Allah, it's going to be made easy, inshallah. But if there is any other things attached to it, and that becomes the core reason, then it's going to be very, very challenging. Okay, so I would advise anybody who have certain intention, whether it's because of the guy, because, or whether it's because of children, or whether because it is uh, society pressuring you to settle down and all that, to shift your paradigm of understanding what marriage is all about. Okay, it's okay if you want this, 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 but the core has to be for him. For Allah. Yeah, so the uh, the wrap up is you should choose to get married, choose to get married because of Allah, not because of other people or other things. Mm, okay, I like so that. I think the, 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 the choice of word is very important. Mm. Okay, I, I really like when she said choose to get married because I have heard some uh, ladies who say that, so that I need to get married. So that I need to get married. Okay, so um, I think that's a golden tip. Okay, your choice of word is very important because when you choose to do something, whatever adversity comes, inshallah, you're going to aim to handle it. Sure. All the best! It's not a matter of can or cannot because um, ultimately the reason that we agree to get married should be because of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. If you get married for the sole purpose of having Zuriat, and who can guarantee that you're going to have Zuriat? Yeah. You should choose to get married, choose to get married because of Allah, not because of other people or other things. Hey, thank you everybody for watching. If you like and benefited from this video, do drop us a like. If you're new here, remember to hit the bell button and subscribe, then share. As Rasulullah SAW mentioned, whoever guides someone to goodness will have similar reward. So come and join us to gain this reward together. And let us all help one another to be the best that we can be. Ma'asalamah! Ma